Hey guys, how are ya? How are things going? Danielle at Summerfield Farm and Draft Horses here, and it's raining. Oops, there's a rock. Hold on, I moved a rock. It's raining, again, again. I was gonna take Jarvis out, just a minute, but uh, it's raining. So, uh, as any good person, ooh, it's cold rain too. As any good person will do, um, we're gonna change up a little bit of what we're gonna do. So instead of going for a ride, which I guess I don't mind getting stuck out in a ride, but I don't wanna start in a ride. And I don't think they want to either because they're like, they're over there. But I wanted to come out and I wanted to see the run-in. Um, the new girls are over there. They're in the, the shed, the run-in over there. But anyway, I wanted to see about our new run-in and if my waterproofing helped. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I, I know I'm getting wet. I'm getting soaked. But I have my nice yellow rain slicker on and I got my boots. So, and my phone is waterproof, so. <laughs> Alrighty, let's see how well I did. Um, I know I've got to get a couple more pieces in the back. Um, well, I did pretty crappy. It's still leaking quite a bit. Quite a bit. Over there. But it's not quite as bad as it was. I gotta, I didn't realize I did that. Look what I did, design flaw. So I'm gonna get um, some clear and put that there. That way it covers that up and it goes off to the side. But, oh hi boys, how are ya? I know, it's raining, hello. I have a rain slicker on. He's not used to seeing me in the rain slicker. But it's not as bad. I mean, it was dripping all over the place and now it's only dripping in some of the places. Like some of these areas, like right here, I could just come up and, and get those taken care of. And it's really hard to get it like up underneath the board. So, I don't know. Come on in, Darcy. What are you doing? Come on, come on. Come here. He's like, no, you're wearing this yellow thing and you look silly. Jarvis, it's all right. Calm down. Calm down, easy. Easy. There you go. There you go. There. There you go. I know. I don't want to be wet either. Good boy. Come on, Dars. Come on in. I know it's getting a little wet. Ooh. So, yeah. I'll put you guys there for right now. Um, yeah, it's, it's better than it was. But it's still really drippy. There's a hole right there. But it's not, not nearly as bad. Not nearly as bad. Now, I don't know if you'll be able to see that. I'm going to try, but right there, that one drip that's coming down, it was all drippy. It was like all like, oh, hi. <laughs> I didn't know he turned around. Um, it was all like that, just pouring in. But it's not anymore. We're going to stay here with you. I don't know what he's looking at. That's a, that, this is the bad side. That's the good side. of the Belgian that I bought. Come here, Mr. B. I'm getting soaked over there, handsome. Come on over here. I'm still talking with the owners of the Belgian that I bought from at the auction last week. So he's still 
he's still talking. And talking and talking. But I guess he went up to Pennsylvania this weekend. I guess to another horse auction. And uh, he wanted to trade the Belgian for another horse. And I really don't want to because he's just going to trade her and put her in another auction or send her off to slaughter or something. Uh, it won't be good if that's what happens. Um, so I talked to him this morning and uh, he said he hasn't found a, a replacement horse. I said, good, because I don't want a replacement horse. I want my money back. And, you know, we'll see what happens with her. Um, I've been giving her Buteless for the past few days and it really, it wasn't doing a lot. It actually really made it worse. Um, but for the past two days, I've been giving her a double dose of Devil's Claw, which is what he gets. And uh, she, I actually watched her walk around confidently on it today. So she's feeling better, but it's just a cover-up. It's just a band-aid. Her pain will never go away. She won't ever be 100% sound. And uh, it'll just, that's not a way to live. At least not for people. So I wouldn't want to an animal to live that way either. So, right? Right? Do you want to come over here and say hi? Come over here and say hi? You can't go that far. You got her? try to get my money back on her and he says he'll be back in town tomorrow and it's not like I can get my money back while he's in Pennsylvania so just gotta be patient I gotta wait and see what happens see what he does um, I've talked to a lawyer and it'll be too expensive I mean she's only she's not very expensive but uh, she's enough enough but anyway, it, it'll be too expensive to hire a lawyer. It won't be worth it. So I'll probably bring him to small claims court because, you know, sometimes, you know what they say, criminals are not the smartest people in the world. And I still have copies of the, the video that they sent over that says that clearly does not say that the horse was sold as is. So I can use that, bring that to the judge, let him know go from there if it goes that far hopefully it won't I'm hoping it won't because he seems like he's gonna be a kind of a decent guy but I'm patient I'll wait until Tuesday and uh, which is tomorrow and uh, <coughs> excuse me we'll go from there so you guys are still getting used to it in here huh yeah yeah little Darcy he turns so black when he gets wet. Check this out. He gets pitch black. He's like, I don't want anybody showing anything in my face. He's so camera shy. He's looking at me through that one eye. Hey, buddy. You relaxing? You look a little nervous. You can see it on his face. He looks a little nervous. But at least I can. He's probably a little nervous. Sounds different in here with all the dripping and the rain. Let's see what your ears look like. Easy. 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 Hey. Alright. You're uncomfortable. Alright. I know. I'm wearing a bright rain slicker. I know. This is so different. I haven't trained you with this yet. Very good. I'm going to take my hand away. Oh, training opportunity. Go forward. There. Watch this. I'm going to put you guys here. We're going to train for a second. I'm going to train with a rain slicker. What do you think? Can you just park?
gave me his face. That's really good. Let me get out of the way a little bit. I'll put you guys maybe a better spot. Maybe you can see better over here. You might be a little crooked, but you should be able to see better. negative experience and now he's not going to want me to get near him now with this because now he's kind of afraid of it so let's desensitize him a little bit better with going slower again hey darling over there because that is his way to get away. It's his escape. That's all right, Jarvis. gets that it's not going to hurt him when it's near him or on him. And he Break in the rain. Check that out. It's a break in the rain. 
It's getting there. It's just this little bit that's overhead. That's coming my way. So maybe we could do some riding after all. Get a an eye gunky in your eye. Is that better? Yeah. You just relax. Such a good horse. I love this guy. He's just resting. Mr. Scary Cat over there. He's just resting. Right? What's he doing? He's over there. Alright guys, well, um, I'm gonna hang out here with the horses for a little while longer and I'm not gonna board you. I'm at 16 minutes already, so. Um, that's a little bit of uh, raincoat training in weird situations and sounds and with Mr. Scaredy Cat over there. <laughs> you guys have a great day. Um, it's already stopped raining. The sun's gonna come out. I think we might be able to go for a ride after all. See you later. Bye.